What's up everybody? Today we're going to be taking a look at Graham Cracker Comics in Chicago. Uh, they've got some cool toys and I love coming here. Let's go. Check it out. Some cool toys like that. Is this like a almost like a hot toy? Uh, kind of. What are these things in the Iron Man, I've got this one. A really nice figure. I haven't opened it yet, but I think it's such a good retro cloth figure. It's based around the Iron Maiden character. Eddie, he's called. This probably Dread Pirate Roberts. Definitely a weird line for a McFarlane tackle, but. I gotta give it to something different. This is a cool turtles mashup with the Power Rangers. Really unique designs, and I like this idea. Pretty cool. Marvel Legends. It's pretty cool. I haven't seen this one. I'm just starting to get into Marvel Legends myself. This sets in sale right now at Best Buy, I think, for 20 bucks. Very good likeness to the actors. Everybody's favorite clown. Still such a good, good thank you set for sure. Really nice. I would recommend people pick this one up. Check it out. Ben Riley Spider Man. We got Shocker down here. A lot of people are painting in <laughs> the, uh, the grid lines on his suit. Um, just because, for whatever reason, they didn't do it. I don't know why, but it looks way better with the painted. Tigra. I've seen her going for real cheap right now. I like the design though. She looks very poseable and the ultimate sculpt is pretty nice. Like this, how they got this Joe 2 pack. This looks like such a throwback. I think I may have had one or two G.I. Joes growing up. Got the cloth pants. Over 50 for it. Whoa, check out this film. Diamond Selects is awesome. Great paint. That's from the hands. Action. Not familiar with Legion. I think he's Magneto's son. Here we have Magneto. Love the braids. Nice look. by Diamond Slacks. Just pure flame on, an alternate head scope. I like the translucent body though. Yeah. Flame hands, really cool. Some flame effects in the back. Check it out. Oh wow. Super 7 Iron Giant. This is cute. Oh, check it out. There's a small figure down there, too. My Bloody Valentine, so the original cloth figure. Really nice. Harry Warden. Hopefully we get ultimate release for this, too. Anthony Hopkins. He's got quite a few action figures under his belt. Really good likeness to him, too, I think. Very much so. I didn't even know book two was out. I love Sean Murphy's work. I mean, his White Knight series is definitely like a breath of fresh air to the Batman mythos. I love the new take. I had no idea this was even out. Hyatt Toys Alien. Exclusive mini. These are really nice. I have oh, one of the Predator figures. Really like it. They're so detailed. I mean, for the scale, incredibly detailed. Well, this is by Diamond Selects. They did an excellent job there, too. I haven't seen the movie yet, but uh, I'm definitely a fan of Morbius. Hopefully, I won't be too disappointed. I haven't heard, I've heard mixed things about it. We got some gremlins down here. Really good detail on those. Soft uh, cloth goods. Look at this uh, Fezzik, Andre the Giant. There's actually an alternate uh, variant of this when he uh, he actually comes with a cloak. 
peanut. You can focus in there. Really pretty good likeness to him too. Another diamond silex figure. Pretty good sculpt there. I think this is an excellent Iron Giant. Voiced by Vin Diesel from the film. Next and second issue of Endless Winter, the Justice League run. I, have, I think I have two of the figures in the line, but I've never actually gotten into this particular storyline, so I'm going to definitely pick these up. Let me know in the comments what you guys are reading, if anything, uh, recently. If you're buying trades, if you're buying singles, let me know. Um, Black Series, Star Wars figures, Lando, very common figure, see him everywhere. Is that a Han? No, oh, it's just a regular Rebel Trooper. And Jyn Erso. Nice. We got a Poe Dameron. Kinda looks like Oscar Isaac, kinda. Jenna. Wasn't she supposed to be Lando's daughter? I kinda wish I would've waited on these original superheroes. I thought that they were going basically to never be put back into production, but I found some at Target. I didn't pay too much overpriced, but I'm glad I got my Phantom though. He's a great figure, real standout. This Ming is really good too with the cloth cape. Really nice accessories in there. For my Sonic people. Oh nice, check it out, they have an Elvira here. I didn't see that anywhere. This is the first time I've seen it in a while. Oh, and they've got the Grapnel Launcher replica. I've been looking for that. They've got a bunch. I picked up the Batarang the other day too. Oh, and they've got the Batman Beyond Batarang too. Nice. Pops for my pop people. 007, Candyman, Squid Games. More pops, pops for days, so many, endless variety. I am very intimidated with pops. All right, so that was Graham Cracker Comics, a great shop to go to whenever you need to find something cool. Um, thank you guys for watching. If you could please comment, like, subscribe. If you're enjoying the content, I've got plenty more to come. Stay tuned.